Hello chess lovers, I would like to show you the oldest known chess game played about 1475 in Valencia, with the white pieces playing Francesco di Castelvi and his opponent is Narciso Vignoles. Castelvi started with e4 and in the oldest known chess game we see Scandinavian defense d5 by Vignoles, he takes d5, queen takes d5, Knight c3, now black has several options, queen a5, queen d6, queen a8, but this time we see queen a8, bishop c4, knight f6, knight f3 and bishop g4. Not a good move which allows white to go for a beautiful tactical shot. Actually this is a very common mistake in Scandinavian defense. After bishop g4 white can go for bishop takes f7 check, if king takes f7 then knight d5 check for king the king and the bishop, or after bishop g4, white can play even more brutally and place the knight on e5 square and sacrifice the queen. Of course the queen can't be captured because of this bishop takes f7 mate. Or after knight e5, if bishop e6 then simply bishop takes e6, f takes e6, queen f3 and of course black has a very unpleasant position with so many weaknesses in his camp. Let's go back, but after bishop g4, Castelvi didn't use his chance and he played h3. Bishop takes f3, queen takes f3 and a blunder by black e6, black is blundering the pawn on b7, queen takes b7, knight d7, knight b5 coming after this c7 pawn. And also white can even play more beautifully, queen takes a8 and then knight takes c7. Rook c8, but now the white knight is simply grabbing the pawn on a7. Knight b6, of course there was nothing wrong with rook b8, but we see knight b6 and now the knight is also capturing the rook. Knight takes c8 d4, knight d6, bishop b5 check, knight takes b5, queen takes b5, knight d7, d5, white wants to open up the center and target black king, he takes d5, bishop e3, bishop d6, rook d1 and queen f6. Well actually castling kingside would have been better, though on the other hand in those times castling rules were different and maybe that was the reason that black had different ideas and played queen f6. And now white is capturing on d5. Queen g6, bishop f4, not a good move. After this move black can actually get some counterplay by playing queen e4 check. If bishop e3 then queen takes g2, if rook f1 then queen takes h3, though again white has a huge advantage. But instead after bishop f4 we see bishop takes f4, which is losing on the spot. Here comes queen d7 check and after king f8 white announced mate by playing queen d8. If you enjoyed the oldest known chess game, don't forget to give the thumbs up or subscribe to my channel, more games are coming. Good luck.